Welcome to the SolidKM University channel. In this video, we'll continue our series of videos on the HSR, HSM constraint boundary option. We'll be talking about the created manual section, and we'll be talking about the third option, boundary box. So the HSR, HSM toolpaths are solid recognition toolpaths, and the constraint boundaries limit the travel of the tool. So in this case, what we'll be doing with the bounding box is we will tell it where on the part we'd like to machine by selecting surfaces, and it'll actually place a box around that and limit the travel within the box. Very similar to what you've seen in the created automatically section. This time though, it's based off of the surfaces we selected. So it's a way to target the movement of the tool. So I'm just gonna go and add a HSM toolpath. Go to constraint boundaries, boundary box, click on the new geometry button. And the geometry it's looking for, we just click select, is the surfaces that we like to machine, the exact surfaces we like to machine. So in this case, I'm just gonna click on these three surfaces here. Click the green check mark. Click the green check mark to accept it. And essentially you'll see that it generates a box around those exact surfaces. So it would actually limit the travel to entirely inside this box. So even though I told it to machine these surfaces, because of the L shape, it actually is including that area there as well. So this is a very basic way to define the constraint boundary. You're just basically saying, put a box around all the surfaces that we'd like to machine. Now, if you really wanted to target just those three surfaces and only within the contours of that surfaces, then you could take a look at the other options in this playlist, in that, in that list of options. But this one here is very basic. You choose the surfaces and it places that box flush on all sides around the part. So stay tuned to the other options listed in this playlist on this YouTube channel.